Hey guys, I'm LB, and we got our 90 back. We got our 90 back in the last episode. Good old 90. Whee! Look how high it takes us, holy crap. <laughs> Alright, well. Let's see what we've got now. Has this changed anything, or is it just changed by the fact that we came into the level? And it erased... It erased my good old friend here. That's unfortunate. Oh, and they took my 90 away! Ah, oh, come on! <laughs> Hold on a second. Will I have my 90? I wonder. I wonder. No! Interesting. What if I quit? And then... Then I continue. Will I have my 90 then? No. Okay, so it must have been held over from the previous episode. So I could have jumped out with my 90, kept my 90. Man, I messed up. <laughs> Alright, so. Did I get anything else, though? Because they took my stuff away, now I've got it back again? Yeah, I'm pretty sure at the end of the last episode some stuff was missing. Uh, I don't exactly understand how that happened, or how that works, but... Whatever. <laughs> This game is not particularly impressive, in terms of the... What is even happening right now? Was I originally gonna go that way, now you want me to go this way? What do we have in here? What? Isn't that a way out? Okay then. Is that another way out? I feel like I could've broken this. I really do. By just skipping some vital triggers, I think. In fact... I'm interested to see if I can or not. Don't have 90, but we'll have the next best thing, 50. Let's see here, in the Y direction. We want to... apply force... to the colliding object. There we go. Yeah, that path is open right now, interestingly enough. Well, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, well, that also was a, wasn't what I wanted to do, but I guess it works. Oh no! <laughs> There's an invisible wall here. No matter. We'll just jump over it. And there's not even any geometry there! <laughs> well, isn't that interesting. At least there's geometry here. Oh, and I fell off, because of course I did. Let's try this again, please. I'm gonna break this game as much as I can. Yeah! Yeah! I'm over here now. Screw you and your restrictions on where I can and can't go. Does that even lead anywhere? Wait, isn't this... I think this is the first area. This is one of the earlier puzzles we did. I distinctly remember this area as being one of the earlier ones we did. Huh? Where does this take me? Um, I'm afraid to go through this. Oh no! <laughs> uh, I sure hope... Well... <laughs> I am here now! 
I don't even know where here is. Um... Quit. Story. Well, oh well. <laughs> I guess we'll never see what was supposed to happen in that- in that level. Oh hey, we're back here! Fancy that. Now we can do things the intended way. I'm sure glad it didn't save my progress. But now I'm curious. So it wants us to go this way. I wonder if it'll take us to the same place or a different place. I guess we get to find out, right? Good old... 50s. There we go, there's a 50. In the Y direction. And we want to use the colliding object. With... No. With physics. Apply force! There we go. Come on now. There's that much taken care of. And I guess we want to turn this invisible, right? The if function? Ooh, now we're finally getting into conditionals after we feel like we're halfway through the game. Really now. The if node has two major components. A true-false input and an output of your choice for when the input condition is met. The top input must be a true-false condition. Yeah, well, I mean, it's got- it's got that data type, so... The bottom input could be whatever you like. This is what the if mode will output should the top input return true. Interesting. Well, there's that. Good old 50 coming to use again. Oh wow, this is a- this is a sound you don't hear very often in games. The sound of rain hitting some sort of surface. Right, we gotta look through that portal to see if we're gonna even end up in the same place or not. Cause I might have found like a secret bonus level or something. Who even knows. There we go. So let's see, where is this gonna take me? That's somewhere different. That is somewhere different. Really? Maybe I did find a secret then. Maybe that's why I didn't save my progress. Hmm. Now you got me real curious. Let's see here. Apply deadly force. To... Oh, I do get the vectors back now. That's nice. With, uh... No. No. Objects. Colliding object. Got these the wrong way around. Ah, oh, come on. And it cleared my code, because of course it did. Let's try this again. So let's see here. I keep clicking the wrong stuff, but whatever. Apply force. Objects, colliding object. There we go. Let's just do this approximately the same way we did before. Maybe with a few differences. So just making this actually a makeable jump. There we go. And then we have to get over this invisible wall, but that's fine.
There we go. Almost. So let's see where this takes us. Yeah, this is definitely a different place. Where have we ended up? Really? That's already set up for me? Wait, what? That was mine? Interesting. That was just my thing. Do I have 90 yet? No, I still don't have 90. Where is this and why am I here? Wait! <laughs> oh, wow, I just got the wool pulled over my eyes. Holy crap! That portal doesn't take me anywhere, that's just a mirror. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Alright, well... <laughs> oh, man. I thought I went somewhere else. Nope. <laughs> that just takes you right back where you came from. I'm an idiot. Yep. It's like the- it's like the ones at the start of the level. Right, let's go through this the normal way, then. Kara was thinking I was being all clever. Alright, how many times are we going to do this? Apply deadly force. Ah, oh, I got this bug again? Are you kidding me? Why does that bug happen? It's like they didn't even test the game. Apply force, please. 50. There we go. Gotcha. 50. And we're out of here. Interesting. What's this blue area? All right, let's go through onward. Not in the same place as before. Yep. Namespace updated. Oh. We have multiple maths. Not just one math, multiple maths. Now, I know that's a UK versus US thing, but, uh, you know, the word ends in an S if you say mathematics, but math is a plural word already. Math is already plural, just like sheep is already plural. It's, uh, yeah. That's how it works. You can't have more than one math. There's only one math in the whole world. If you say maths, that means you- you're like, there's other universes with different laws of physics and different maths. But there's only one math that we have in our world. Anyway, enough of that rant. What am I doing here? What am I doing here? They've got some weird if statements set up for me, but I don't know what I need them for. Oh, I need it for 50. Cause they don't give me 50 anymore. So... I want to move it... Wait, no, that's not gonna help. What can I do? I can stretch. Okay, that'll help. And then I want to do it along the z-axis. Hello. Hello, sir, how are you? Where 
What can I do to you? Come on now. Give me a 20. Along the Y axis. I wonder... Nope, I can't stretch myself. Okay. <laughs> it would've been interesting. There we go. I'm guessing I need to go over there, right? So... Now we need the X-axis. Interesting, it only disconnected the main from itself. Didn't disconnect anything else. Cool sound effects, but, uh... Why is there so much walking involved? This is the fastest I can move, and you're making me walk down a long flight of stairs. I would at least appreciate a sprint button. Oh, now you're changing my name spaces up? Now what? Now what's happening? Wait, what? So I can't use false, so... Okay then, what do I need false for? The... Physics? Use collisions? Maybe. Still doesn't work on me for some reason. Apparently I am a read-only thing. Even though it's the same color. I guess that's the end of this area. I mean, there's a giant red floor here. Come on! <laughs> Tricking me. Right, well... What, I can cut this? Can I use... Can I just do this? Really? Uh, crap. Wait, really? Are you serious? Um. What was all the other stuff for? Did you even test this? Did you even look at this with your brain and realize anything about it? Do you even understand what you've done? What was all the other stuff here for? I didn't even have to pay attention to any of it. Why would you design something like that, even if it was intentional? That doesn't make any sense. Ah well, whatever. This game's already let me down in terms of quality. I feel like the person who made this didn't even really understand it themselves. Which is a sad thing to say about a game. Apply deadly force. Uh... Can I... Oh, this is locked. Oh, I have to have the impact force greater than 50. Okay. Well, I can handle that. See, nope. Apply deadly force. Fifty. There we go. Oh. Wait, what? I guess we're going down instead. Huh. Yeah, there's nothing up. Oh my gosh! That is not at all where I expected us to be going. And now I can't edit it from here, it's too far away. Okay, what do we change now? Can no longer stretch or translate. Can no longer mess with collisions. Hey, we got 90! 90's back! Alright. We can apply deadly force with 90 units of it. Right, I need the direction first. 
long Y to the colliding object. We. <laughs> Why would they give me that? It's so overpowered. <laughs> oh man, that's great. Hooray! <laughs> oh man, it's just so much fun. Look how high we can go! Oh, the game actually kinda lags from this height. Interesting. Where am I meant to be going, actually? What the? What is that? Create physics cube. Okay then. Uh. Oh good, they disappear. After a while. We need a stronger impact force. Okay, so we have to do stuff here then. So let's see here. Let's apply force. None of these directions are good, because I need to go negative. I don't have negative numbers, do I? No, they still won't give me any negative numbers. What am I supposed to do if they don't give me any darn negative numbers? I guess I could use myself. Oh. Whoops. Oh my gosh, stop doing that. Hmm. Ninety? Ninety! Oh, come on now. That should have been plenty of force. Right, fine. I'll do it myself, then. Which direction is this one going? In the Z direction. I want... Vectors along Z. There we go. Problem solved. Left click on physics cubes to remove them from the world. Okay. If collision count is greater than zero. How many cubes do we still get in here? Oh, plenty. Plenty of cubes. Let's see, we want the X direction now. Actually, let's just do X and Y. And Z, why not? That's not what I wanted. Uh, excuse me, that's not also not what I wanted. Oh, that's not what I wanted, but that works! <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> Great Fixes Cube has been added to your toolbox. Alright. <laughs> Holy crap, man, this game. It is hilarious for all the wrong reasons. Alright. No, you took away my three-way vector. That's okay.
I can make do without it. Oh no, you took away my 50! And my 90! You just don't want me to have big numbers, do ya? Right. Uh, no. Physics? Apply force! Apply deadly force. And... abstraction... create physics cube... Uh... Wait, can I do the colliding object? Create physics cube? Would that work? Apparently that doesn't work. Fine. Where are these physics cubes even going? Oh, just creates them slowly over time, I suppose. Right, well, not quite what I expected. Apply force! Okay then. Let's just move that in the way then. Let's transform it. We can't stretch it. Well, great. What am I supposed to do then? They don't want me out there. Alright, fine. Oh, that's also not where I wanted to be. Oh, come on! You took away my code. Stop doing that! It's annoying. I can't apply force from there anymore? But I can do it from... from... from physics. Why is that a thing? Why- why even bother like that? Alright, I need to do it to myself. Right, and this doesn't even bounce us very high in the first place. Fine. Fine, fine, fine. Let's see here. Transform. Rotate. Along the Z-axis. Wait a sec. No, I can't add yet. They still have not given me the ability to add together. So the most I can do is... that. Yeah, like, that's gonna help. <laughs> yeah, that's absolutely useless. Not even where it needs to be. Okay, what about... What about along the x-axis? What if I make a ramp? That's the wrong direction. What am I even supposed to do here? That was interesting. Oh no, I'm slipping! I'm falling! Oh, come on! I'm so close. Oh, something hit me. What am I even supposed to be doing here? I don't... You're like... There's nothing invisible there. Can I modify this one? No. Can I modify this one? 
No, this is fully- these are both fully locked down. I cannot modify them. What the heck am I supposed to do? Yeah, that's not helping either. Uh... Yep, they won't give me the multiple transform. I- they won't give me negative numbers. What the heck do they want from me, man? I don't- I don't understand... Do I need to create physics objects? Is that- how would that help, though? I really don't see how it would help, but I mean, I guess I'll try it. Create physics cube. Why the heck not? Oh! What? How was I supposed to know that would happen? I guess I could've looked at it, right? Um, but still. How am I supposed to get over there? Without killing myself? It stretches it, but then what? Yeah, that's not exactly looking too useful to me, to be honest. Nice stretch. No, I cannot stretch. I can move. Right, I need... Uh... Move object... Along... Z? Y? Maybe Y? I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. What?! Come on! You just cleared all my code for no reason. What am I- what the heck am I supposed to do here? I'm thoroughly confused. Well, apparently that's a thing I can do. Not sure... why. But let's see here. Great business cube. There we go. That's what I wanted. Right, okay. Well, we made it over here, and I'm not entirely sure if that was intended or not. But the more I break this game, the better I feel about it. Oh, that's not... that's not what I wanted to do. I just wanted to look down there. Didn't want to actually fall down. What is going on there? Okay, we need four cuboids. Gotcha. That's easy enough to do. Why are they disappearing now? And why is it not sending me flying? Oh, cause I- I'm part of the collision count, apparently. Oh, come on. I need to do it when I'm not on it. Okay. Wow, that launches you quite high, doesn't it? Do I get any big numbers yet? Nope, nope, no big numbers yet. What was the number on this one? Oh, I can't even- What?! What kind of stupid game is this that you can't even look all the way down?
This one is... Well, four times fifty! Oh, that's why, so it's two hundred. That's what the number is. Oh, come on now. Oh, come on! Why is this- why is this so frustrating? Ha! At least I'm somewhere I'm not supposed to be. Let's see here. 20. Y direction. Oh, come on. Gotta make me do it the old fashioned way. Physics. Apply force. And of course, it didn't take me anywhere. <laughs> Fine. Interesting. Cursor over. Well, I suppose that was your dose of antechamber for the day. Nothing behind here? Okay. Right, well, that's- this episode is long enough, I think, so... As always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I will see you all in another video. Goodbye!